Hello everyone. We all know that ChatGPT can solve problems, generate contents and even help you in coding. Today in this video we will show you how we can make an app for Android and iOS using ChatGPT. Let's get started to make an app. Go to ChatGPT and tell ChatGPT about the idea for an app that you want to create and explain it that how it should work. In this video we will create a simple app. Let's tell ChatGPT that I want to make a single web page. This page will be in HTML, CSS and JavaScript and will be mobile responsive. It will consist of three tabs. Tabs will be in bottom of screen. First tab will be for home. Second tab will be for about. Third tab will be for contact us. You can see that we have got the HTML, CSS and JavaScript code. Now to check if the code is working correctly. Let's use a tool called CodePen. So, visit to CodePen website and click on Pen to start. Here you can see we have three different sections where you have to enter the HTML, CSS and JavaScript code respectively. So, let's go back to ChatGPT, then copy the HTML code and paste it here in HTML section. Now do the same for CSS and then do for JavaScript code too. Once you have pasted all codes then check the result in the preview section. Test all three tabs by clicking on each tab one by one. Next, we want to add list of 10 items in home tab. So, let's back to chat GPT and ask, in home tab, I need 10 items in a list. List item will be light blue color. Items per line will be two. Chat GPT will create new code. First copy the HTML code and replace it with home content in CodePen. Now copy the CSS code and paste into the CSS portion. Now check the preview, it will show you list item in home tab. Now we want to add content to about tab. So, Let's back to ChatGPT and ask it about tab will consist of about statement for a software house. It will also consist of links to Facebook page, Twitter account, YouTube channel and Instagram. ChatGPT will create code for it. Now copy the HTML code and replace it with about content. Then copy the CSS code and paste into the CSS portion. Now check the preview for result. It will show you the updated content of about. Now we want to add content to contact us tab. So, let's back to chat GPT and ask it contact us tab will consist of a contact form, email address, postal address, phone number, website link and Skype ID. ChatGPT will create code for it. Now copy the HTML code and replace it with contact us content. Then copy the CSS code and paste into the CSS portion. Now check the preview for result. It will show you the updated content of contact us. Now I want to add a splash screen when my application start loading. Let's back to chat GPT and ask it please add a splash screen for 2 seconds at page loading. Splash screen will contain a message welcome to gadgets focus. Chat GPT will create code for it. Now copy only the new div tag code in HTML section and paste the code in start of body tag. Now copy the CSS code and paste into the CSS portion in CodePen. Then copy JavaScript code and paste into the JS section in CodePen. Now check the preview for result. It will show you the splash screen on loading. 
Now we want to download the whole source code to our computer. So, let's start it by clicking on export button. Now click on export.zip option. It will download the source code zip file to our computer. Extract the zip file and open the folder. Now open SCR folder. You will see index.html, script.js and style CSS in this folder. Open index.html file in any editor and check this style.css file name to be same as CSS file in SRC folder. Also check script.js file name to be same as JS file in SCR folder. Next, we want to convert this web page into mobile app. You can install it on your mobile device, share it with your friends and also you can publish it to Play Store. First, we need to upload this source code to web hosting. You can also upload it to your own hosting. Here I am using a free web hosting tool for testing called 000 web host. So let's visit this website and click on get started button. Sign in or sign up to this website. Now click on start now button. Type name for your website and then type password. Now click on create button. Now select Upload Site option as we want to upload own source code files. Now click on public underscore HTML and drag and drop your source code files here. It will upload your files. Now go to the main panel of hosting tool and click on three dots and then click on View Site. Now you can see that our app is live on the internet. So. We successfully hosted our app online. Once it done, now we can go to the final step in which we will convert the web app into mobile app. So, we are using a tool called Webinto app. This tool is free to use for Android app. If you want this app for iOS and also source code of this app for customization, then you have to pay for it. Visit webintoapp.com Click on Get Started button. Now give name to your app and type company or brand name too. Set icon for your app. When you select icon for your app, then click on Next button. Now select Free Android App option. Click on Make App button. If you are not registered, then register yourself. If already have an account, then log in. Now it will start making your app. When it finishes the processing, then click on download icon and select download free option. It will download your app. Unzip the downloaded file and open the unzip folder. You will see apprelease.ab, apprelease.apk and a release key. Keep the release key safe as it will be used for updates in future for Play Store. Now to check this app on our mobile, we will upload these files to Google Drive. When upload to Google Drive completed, then open the Drive app in your mobile. Search for these files and click on apprelease.apk file. It will start the app installation process. Now click on install button. Now click on more details and then click on install anyway. The warning message unsafe app block is shown because we install it directly to our phone and it's not from Google Play Store. When installation completed, then open the app. As you can see that our app has successfully converted from web app to Android app. You can make any type of app like this one in just short time and with no development and coding expertise. If you are looking for more amazing tutorial or AI tools, then please subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for early updates. Thanks for watching.